Today I'm gonna make chicken biryani which is one of my favorite dish and it's not at all hard to make. I'm gonna show you in my video. Hey everyone, Assalamu Alaikum. I hope you will be very good. It's me Zobia and welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe and share with your friends and family. So without wasting time, let's start. I'm gonna use a shan biryani masala and then I'm gonna use 4 medium sized chopped tomatoes green chili as you can see ginger garlic paste but you can also use a fresh garlic or ginger it's totally up to you this is my first batch of boiled rice and the second batch is in a rice cooker and i am using a black decker rice cooker it's highly recommended and very convenient and these are the medium chopped three onion i'm using and lastly we have a chicken which I already washed. So in our first step, what I'm gonna do, I onions ko brown karungi. So for that, I already took a oil, and here I'm gonna put all my medium-sized chopped onion. So keep mixing it until it turns brown. And once, if you see, ke wo brown ho gaye, then you usko plate mein nikal le. Second step, me aap usi oil ke andar chicken add kare, but make sure keep the flame medium to low, and then keep adding all the chicken, and then mix gently until it turn brown a little bit, and then add ginger garlic paste and keep mixing it. Now you can add tomatoes and mix it well. Then you can add green chilies, two teaspoons salt. 1 and 1/2 teaspoon red chili, 1 turmeric, 1 teaspoon cumin powder and 1 teaspoon coriander powder. And then you can add Shan Bombay biryani packet which I'm using one full packet. You can use any other brand, it's totally up to you. Now we're going to mix gently and wait until our chicken is ready. Add some fried onion in the chicken and some keep it for the last part. It will take 10 to 15 minutes until our chicken is properly cooked and once it's cooked and all the water is dried then you can take it out in a plate. So now we are at the last step and it is just a layering. I'm gonna use the same pan and as you can see I add some rice, our cooked chicken and again I'm gonna add the other layer of rice and some our fried onion and again cooked chicken that's how you're gonna make all the layers and at the end I make my last layer and then I am gonna add the colored water a little bit so it just give a good color to our rice and leave it for five minutes our chicken biryani is almost ready now just mix gently to incorporate everything with one another and then dish out in a plate and it's gonna be ready to eat I hope you guys like it please do try at home thank you for watching